From the Academy Award-winning composer of the Broadway blockbuster Wicked comes a musical freely based on the book of Genesis. Experience the spark of creation and the epic of Noah's flood like never before in a story of family, second chances, and hope. Featuring Destiny's Child's Michelle Williams and Grammy-winning gospel artist David Phillips, internet singing sensation Sam Suey, GMA Dove Award winner Corin Hawthorne, and Broadway star Randall Keith. Don't miss Children of Eden in concert. Visit broadwayinchicago.com for tickets. Hi, everyone. It's from Row Phyllis. Based on the biblical book of Genesis, Children of Eden tells the story of creation through the epic of Noah's flood. Heartfelt and humorous examination of the relationship between the parent and child. Children of Eden provides a timeless story and incredible music for the entire family to enjoy. Well, joining us today is one of the lead actors. I'm talking of Children of Eden, the concert. I'm talking about David Phelps. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> it's good to be with you. Oh, this is awesome. We're so excited. It's, it's a shame that it's going to be here for just literally just two shows on Saturday. That's it. I know. You know what? We're, we're testing this out. And, okay. uh, and it's just a lot of fun to be a part of this uh you know the the beginning kind of this. It's not it's not a new musical, and um, it's uh, been done so well. But uh, you know, I think that they're trying to find new legs for okay. it. Okay, so you know, let's jump right in because I want you to tell our viewers a little bit about the production. Just tell us. Well, it's kind of a mix between. Uh, it's it's real unique, and I've never done anything like this before. Okay. It's a mix between a concert production and a you know the, a full blown um, uh, kind of production, kind of uh, to show the audience and uh, people who might be interested that this is this is what it it could be. You know, once once that uh, it gets its wings. So uh, right. it's real interesting. That is amazing. So what attracted you to, you know, want to be a part of this production? You know, what's funny, I was already familiar with Children of Eden. And uh, so years ago, my daughter was majoring in um, musical theater okay. uh, at a university. And they called me, the music department called me and said, hey, will you be a part of this production? Your daughter's in it. It'll be a blast. And I was like, absolutely. You know, that I don't get a chance like that. Right. So I got involved in it, got in, and then my daughter dropped out of school. Oh, and no. I, <laughs> <laughs> and so, so I finished it out with them and it was so much fun. I had such a blast. Right. And uh, then that was just kind of in the past. And then, uh, so when they called me about this, uh, first of all, they called me for a different part than I played before. So um, it was, might as well have just been brand new to me. So, um, but they called me and I already kind of had some familiarity with it. So I, I knew I wanted to be a part of it. I am a huge Steven Schwartz fan. Okay. And, uh, so, um, you know, I think his hand is going to be in this a little bit as well. And so uh, it's- uh, Oh, Absolutely. Cool. Uh, so do you have a favorite um, scene or a favorite song? I'm sure you do. Oh, yes. Or a few, um, right? <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, you know, the other thing, this this production has come together very, very quickly. And so we are all in the process of, you know, cramming our minds full of uh, of all that we need to. And um, it, is, it is quite a difficult score. Uh, for me, I love... Um, I love uh, the, toward the end, um, the, the hardest part of love is one uh, that I really do uh, like a lot. It's one that I start out and sing a lot and then, and then the, the part of father uh, joins me and we kind of do a little duet there, so. Yeah. Oh, you know, I also don't know if our viewers know, but you have a crazy vocal range, uh, three <laughs> octaves, let's just say. What age? <laughs> Or it could be more. Um, what age did you start singing? Yeah, I was born into a singing family. So okay. we, we just always made music. Right. And um, so somewhere about ninth grade, I don't know, what is that, 15 or 16, something like that, Yeah, is when I, my voice kind of started uh, kind of forming what it would, what it would be. Uh, and those, I started just wanting to sing on my own and, and, um, and at that point, I was really pushing my voice because I loved the the kind of the tenor part. And um, I'm so fortunate to have a mom who was like, 
um, I think you need lessons now because you, <laughs> you're kind of pushing past what I know what to do. And um, and so uh, so that was kind of the beginning of my of my journey and uh, and learning all I could about my voice. Right. So we are in the hallway here of this rehearsal area. You are. So we're getting people. We're getting people running back and forth. So this is what it's really like. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> We're taking you really backstage. That's right. <laughs> backstage and behind the scenes. Nobody knows what goes on. Everyone yeah, just sees right. the final product, right? <laughs> that's right. Absolutely. You know, if you didn't go into, you know, singing, um, what do you think you would have done? Uh, probably some other kind of artistic uh, thing. I, I love graphic design or um, engineer architecture, something like that. That's awesome. Really, really does interest me a lot. Oh, we're so excited. You know, we talked a little off camera that you were also in the Gaither band for over 15 years. What made you gravitate towards Christian music? Well, my family used to sing it uh, okay. all very much together. That was the, my first um, exposure to that, of course. And, uh, and, and growing up singing in church, those were the opportunities that I had, you know, and I fell in love. I fell in love with gospel music yeah. and, um, and the way that, uh, I can tell a personal story through a gospel song, you know, uh, that, it, that it's something that my own experience has truly touched and that the people in the, in the audience really relate to that as well. So we got to get to share this, this really personal moment and this about eternal things. And I, I, I fell in love with that. I really did. Yeah. Do you ever miss it? Do you ever miss being in the band? Oh, I, I still sing uh, okay. gospel music and yeah. we, we do a, a lot of uh, different stuff. I've always been very eclectic yeah. in uh, my music choice, but I sing gospel music and I sing uh, some classical and mm -hmm. some Broadway and uh, oh yeah. so yeah. That's awesome. Well, thank you again for joining us. And I have to say, you don't want to miss this powerful production, Children of Eden. The concert oh, yeah. is playing only on Saturday, October 15th at either 2 p.m. or 8 p.m. at the Cadillac Theater. Thank you. And we can't wait to see you on Saturday. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me get me, 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 get